When playing in some LPGA Tour events, one of the things that I noticed that sets the tour players aside from good local pros and top amateurs is their precise iron play. We can all drive it long, we can all sink putts, but knocking those shots in on the pin close enough to sink that one putt is imperative to going super low. And that's what we're gonna discuss in today's lesson. The key to striping your irons lies in coming back to impact consistently from swing to swing with good impact alignments. Now, how can we do that? Well, one thing we can do is mental. We can get over the urge of wanting to help scoop that ball up. Rather, we need to get into our minds that we need to hit down on this golf ball and come into impact with a forward leaning shaft. The other thing that can really help this is a smooth transition from the top of my swing down. If I have a relaxed and smooth transition, I'm going to maintain these angles that I form at the top of my swing and that's going to help my hands come in the lead and the shaft lean forward and the club head trail as you can see there. If I get quick or jerky from the top, chances are I'm going to be casting or releasing early. And the last thing I want to mention is ball position here. If we're moving that ball position around an awful lot, we're going to be much more inconsistent. So I would recommend, like a lot of your tour players do, in fact, the majority of them, a consistent ball position for all your irons. I like to play mine a little bit left of center. So we're going to go ahead and go through this again here. So I've got the ball just a little bit left of center. I'm going to take my club up to the top here, smooth transition down. And as I come into the shot, I'm going to get into my mind. I got to hit down and through the ball. And if I do those three things every single time, I'm going to start to stripe those irons. I'm going to hit them solid. I'm going to have consistent yardages and I'm going to be more, much more accurate into the pin. So here's how it's done. It's simple and it works. Remember, if you have an idea for a lesson, submit it in the Ask Maria section on mygolfinstructor.com.